guys for today's video i'm gonna be doing a bird toy haul and also some cool bird swings for my bird room so let's get started and first i'll just hey guys my cocktails what the names are so this is chief he's busy he wants to eat and then i have over here Comanche and then my girl Savannah and the boys are caged together with my male parakeets and then she's caged with my two female parakeets she is getting a friend a new female cockatiel for her in about three weeks so really exciting cool climbing net he loves confetti so much he's really obsessed with confetti he's like oh so cool yeah he loves confetti so i got from that window stickers for the window behind me and the fish tank so i got some window stickers so that they will not fly into the wall i got this rope for hanging all the toys up a climbing nut, a bigger climbing nut, super cool. Oh, that fell on the ground. Oh, they're gonna love this. Like a swing. So he's in the swing right now. Ready? Probably like overwhelming him right now. So it's that swing, super cool. So I actually got two of these in the haul, but I needed one for my um, female cage. They love these so much. It is the bird kebabs. And I'm just gonna insert a picture of something else that I bought. It's like a wooden thing and it's in their cage. And I'm gonna plan on getting another one of those for my males. But they love those props. The parakeets do. The cockatiels also like it. Parakeets love them. So I ordered one, two, three of this swing. I already had one of it and I just loved it so much. My um, parakeets love it. As you can see, cockatiel approved. And I just love this swing. It's on Amazon. And it's just awesome because they can chew it. And obviously, like, they will destroy a lot of it over time, but it wasn't too expensive, and they love it. So that's it for finches, doves, parakeets, conures, I'm sure would like it. Really, any bird. Probably too big for, like, big parrots, but cocktails, parakeets, all that. So then this is a little destructible toy for their cages. They're going to love it. Some bird gloves. Obviously, never know in the future if I get some more parakeets that I have to train that are not tame. Um, and then also, we have this boy here, Comanche, who is, I've had him. He's my oldest, one of my doves is going crazy bathing. He's my oldest cockatiel, Comanche, and he will let me pick him up because he's very bitey. He has a little attitude, and I need that when I'm um, having to hold him for prolonged time. So there's this awesome swing. This is so cute. And they're gonna love this. So there is. Chief is back. Okay. So good boy. Gonna go up there. So I have this rope um swing for them. They're gonna love this. So cute. I got one of these hang up on the wall. You're gonna love it. Oh, there's some more little things. So like I already have these in everyone's cages. Some people like ropes, some people hate it. It's fine, I've never had an issue with it, but do your research obviously. So got two of these to put in their cages, which I'm gonna 
already have plans on who those are going for. I have two of these. So three in total of those, and there's a oh perfect. I have a little tree that's gonna like go on top of their cage for when they're free roaming for themselves. Oh, you're so curious, buddy. That was it for that box. So I got this. Um, so I got this one. So cute. Like, imagine the bird taking a picture of this. So pretty. So I got that little swim too. So cute. He is like trying to touch everything. So cute. So this is because all of my birds... Well, my girl Kaka feels more reserved, but she loves to chew. But both Comanche and Chief and all my parakeets will mutilate this um, confetti uh, climbing net so fast. They love confetti. So that's super cool. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm just going to let him play with it. So got the NIST, super cool Chinese finger lock kind of things. I've always seen Chinese finger locks as bird toys and I've never gotten one before. Um, but knowing how destructive my birds are, they'll like it. Oh, this is so funny. Okay, this is from Chewy, so if you guys wanna get it. Um, bird, what are the, pinatas, they're called pinatas and I'm scared to let them ruin it because it's so cute. But yeah, so cute. I'll have to take a video of them destroying this. But what do you think, buddy? He's too busy destroying the confetti. His favorite thing. So cute. It's a toucan, I think. Oh, just we ordered two of these. Just got one more of the training um, cups. Because at least for me, Besides Comanche, Comanche will stay and sit on one of these. Um, but my two other cockatiels, like Keith and Savannah, they do not want to stay on the little bird stands unless there's a toy on there. They just get bored so easily. He's like going to town right now. Oh, so much fun. I'm still leave this in the packaging just because it's a confetti like cupcake toy and I don't want to have a confetti go everywhere, but this has Chief's name written all over it. Chief is going to love this, I can already tell. He's like, please let me have it. Confetti toy. Seriously, I go through those so easily. Like, just in the last week, they've gone through three of them. Oh, another little confetti toy. I have two. And then, oh, these are awesome. So I actually, I have quite a few birds, and I only own one of these foraging millets. And I really want to use these because obviously birds, even if they have the most fun enclosure ever, they get bored and you want them to be able to look for their food. You know what I mean? They're just pecking around. It's more effort for them to use those. And then my finches, I would make use those just because they're, they don't need that in my opinion. So for my finches, I wouldn't use those. Um, for my finches and doves, these are going to be fantastic to clip their millet. And my finches go through millet like it's candy, it's crazy. So, second box, empty. Last box, guys. So, we have, I'll just take this out. Oh. Can you chew it on that? It's crazy. We have a confetti toy. Oh, Savannah's pecking at it. So, I have just another hut for my um, finches because they will destroy this hut. They will, they're crazy because they, they want to put everything in the nest. So, finches, 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 finches. another um, confetti toy. You getting overstimulated with all these toys, buddy? <laughs> I have another confetti toy. This is like a mess. They're gonna love it. He's like going to town on this, guys. You should see. Oh my god. So 
so I got two of these to put outside the um, their homes for some trading and just for them to land on. Those are so cute. Oh, also got these platforms. Awesome. Oh my gosh, you know, he's picking my pants now. He's used to clowning on me because with him and Comanche, I would watch movies with him. So, this is a foraging toy. Honestly, I wish people made more of these. If you know of any good ones, please send me links. I'm not sure if this is going to be the best, but it's cute. This is a foraging toy. This will be for their cage, I think. Oh, fake eggs, which I already have used some of them. So, got the fake eggs right here. And I'll show you guys how big they are. So I have finches and doves, which they lay eggs every week. I have two pairs of doves and um, around seven finches. Got this really cute swing. And then only have two more things left. These toys. So yeah, super exciting. Um, so, thank you for watching the bird haul. I hope you enjoyed. I am going to do an update video when all of it is hung up. So, yeah. Tune in for more. Bye, guys.